Hello everyone, it's me Jebby from Enic Tutorials. Today in this video, I will show you how to type superscript and subscript number or letter in Android smartphones. So without any further delay, let's begin. So right now you can see my Android home screen. So firstly, let me show you, say I will just open one node application and right now I have a free installed Gboard that is the Google keyboard. So whether we can type a superscript or subscript using this Google keyboard or not. So let me show you. So you can see in the below written one two three on the Gboard. Just tap on it. Now you can see a numbers, right? So when you press and hold on the respective numbers, you will see a different types of numbers like a fraction and the middle one is the like the superscript so it will act like a superscript and the third one is like the fraction again so if you want to add a superscript then you can just select the second one and you can release so if i type any number then you can see it's on the upper side so if you place the number on the upper area then it's a superscript so what about the subscript so using the gboard application you can type a subscript that is in the below of any number or alphabet so this is not suitable right so you might be thinking which keyboard supports this kind of features so for this what do you need to do just open any play store and just in the play store just search this application name as engineering keyboard just search this application on the first list you can see a application just click on it now you can see a install just tap on install to install it so wait for a few seconds until the complete installation is done so the engineering keyboard application has been successfully installed so now before proceeding further, just head over to the phone settings and just go to the system and you can see now the language and input, right? Just click on it. Now, now you can see your the virtual keyboard. Just click on it. Now you can see here a managed keyboard. Just click on it. Now you need to turn on this engineering keyboard. Just turn it on. Click OK. Click OK. So it's being turned on. Now let's move back to the notes application. So let me delete it. Right now the Google Gboard is a default keyboard, right? So to enable it, you can see on the right bottom below a keyboard like small icon. Just tap on it. Now you can select the engineering keyboard now your engineering keyboard is enabled now you can see in the bottom line mark with the red colors you can see below so you can see the third icon that is from the left and you can see a n and by n so just click on it now here you will get a tons of options to type the superscript and subscript number or letter in your Android smartphone. So you select the N one. That means this N will not indicate any number or will not get typed while you are typing. Just the superscript numbers will get typed. So what about the subscripts, right? So you might be thinking how I will write the subscripts. So for this, you can see on the below line, there's written a subscript, so you can see here a subscript. And to add a number, you can just add a number just by going back. You can just put an A letter and go back to the third option and just type your respective numbers. If you want a superscript, just select the upper line. And if you want a subscript, then just select the bottom line. So you can see in the manner you can type superscript and subscript numbers or letters in android smartphone very easily so if you never known about this cool applications then definitely you should try it out 
and if you find any difficulty in using this cool application feel free to leave your comments below i'll try my best to help and guide you with your problems so if you find this video tutorial useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching